Hey folks, Fallen Titan Andy here doing another game review, so let's check it out. we're looking at today is called Final Stardust Cosmic Nexus. I actually like this game. It's pretty good. It gives me the feel of a mixture of a few games. So you got Yu-Gi-Oh, you've got uh, Pokemon, you've got uh, Marvel Snap. It's got a variation of other card games into it. So it's pretty good. I, I like it and yeah so here's a bit of gameplay. So just in that um, gameplay, you can basically see the actual monsters that you can play. You see them get attacked. You can see abilities in play. It's kind of cool. I, I like it. So let's get on to what needs to be added to the actual game. For starters, I'm just going to say it straight off the bat, PvP. It would definitely be a, a great addition to this game and especially having tournaments and whatnot set up between actual players and yeah, I, I can definitely see something like that happening for this. Of course, you could still keep the AIs in the actual game and have uh, you be able to train with the AI and be like, okay, I don't want this card, I want that card, change it all up. And yeah, so that's one thing I could suggest. Another thing I would like to see is a ranking system. So basically you battle other people and you could earn a rank and that sort of stuff. Another idea I have is basically a tournament tower. It's a bunch of random AI that you could go against and earn uh, a special pack at the end or maybe a few extra coin here or there but you could also do the exact same thing with PvP you could have people compete in this tournament and have uh, a tower where you could face random people in this tournament and earn more gold or earn an actual 
rank like i said before and yeah just basically have fun with that that way and uh yeah So straight off the bat, one of the things I don't want to see is microtransactions. Sure, I know a lot of game devs like to make a little bit money, but in this case, I don't think you really need to. You've got the whole earn coin in-game experience and I do like that it's definitely an interesting way to earn coin by just playing the actual game it's definitely something that should be in all games So there are a few things that need to be added. Um, I don't really have that many ideas on what could be added to a game. They've all been pretty much used. So I've just made a few suggestions here and there. Um, and of course it's entirely up to the devs as to what you add to the game. It, it's your game, you do what you want with it. Um, if you do want to add microtransactions, that's your choice entirely. But I, I, I really think it's definitely something that doesn't really need to be added you know um if sold right if promoted right i think you could make a good game out of this and it would definitely make a bit of money when you're selling it on steam and yeah it's definitely gotten me interested and I, I do like my card games they're very strategic games to keep your mind active and other stuff like that so i do like something like this but yeah that's pretty much it for me i'm gonna leave it there um if you're new to the channel feel free to subscribe and uh check out the other content that i do I cover House Flipper, House Flipper 2, Car Mechanic Simulator, Motorcycle Mechanic Simulator, and I will be bringing in new games eventually. Uh, I'm just basically busy with work and whatnot. So yeah, again, thank you all for watching and I shall see you next time.